Hello everyone, this is Buck WSR Weezer coming at you once again with the 2000 Oldsmobile Silhouette. I'm still working on the P0410 Diagnostic Trouble Code Secondary Air Injection System. In a previous video I talked to you about how I was checking and replacing a diverter valve that wasn't working. I've replaced the air pump which is hidden under this front fender here on the right. Put it all together, but sure enough, it still wasn't fixed. And so now I'm going after the air pump relay. And I'll be doggone if I can figure out where it is. Nobody in the world can tell me where it is. The best I got was that it was some here, somewhere up here near the battery. And there's one down there beside the radiator, but that's a starter relay. That didn't do it. I've been tracking it down like a madman. Such is my quest to resolve this. I believe I've located it. Had to take off the passenger front wheel, remove this uh, dust cover, and I'm thinking it might be that guy right there. Now why they would put it in such an obscure place, it's completely opposite of where the air pump is located on the opposite corner of the vehicle. I can't tell you but I think that's it I'm gonna take it off and hope that that's my uh, solution now, hopefully the, the relay is bad I'll be able to test it and verify that if it's not that if that relay test out just fine I'm not sure where to turn next all right so stay tuned I'm out here and it's starting to rain I'm still wearing my good clothes but such is my desire to find a solution to this little project that get my hands dirty even while wearing my good clothes. All right, I'll check back with you after I get that, that relay off, and hopefully that'll be it. Talk to you soon. Hi, everybody. We're back inside. I got the relay off. Just taking a look on the inside of this. I don't know if you can see that. If there's enough light for that, let me walk over here. Just seeing the inside of that's telling me this has got to be the problem. It's all burnt, charred up. Yup. I put some voltage to it with this 12 volt battery. It didn't do the usual click that a relay should do. Put the continuity tester on the other two uh, tabs in there. And uh, yeah, no, it, it's just no continuity between them. So this, this puppy's bad, and I'm so happy and relieved because this, I've been pulling my hair out with this little project. So hopefully that's of help to you. If you have a Chevy Venture or an Oldsmobile Silhouette or a Pontiac Montana, basically the same GM car, and you're trying to find that secondary air pump relay wow here it is hidden take the wheel off move this dust cover plugs in right there and bolts up to that sidewall there all right i'm going to put a new relay in and hope that we've solved this little problem thanks for watching if this video is of help to you, please give me a thumbs up. You can subscribe to my channel where, where you will see other videos about my, my uh, fun and trying to take care of this vehicle and all I've learned. Feel free to leave a comment if you have one. Bye.